Far too often, the brave men and women who serve our country return home with invisible injuries. Many wounded warriors suffer from brain trauma or post-traumatic stress. News 13's Peyton Lo Cicero tells us there will soon be a place where they can go for help. There are people like me in the community and in the military, still active duty, still performing their mission. However, they might have some battle damage. And where do you go to get that tune up? Eglin Air Force officials are digging into a new project. And this ground that I'm standing on, this is the future home of the Intrepid Spirit Center. The 25,000 square foot facility will be fully equipped to diagnose and treat the invisible wounds of war, traumatic brain injuries, and post-traumatic stress. We have the leaders stepping forth and saying, I too have these things. We're seeing a, a, a great increase in patients willing to come forward and get the care they needed. This trauma center will be an $11 million state-of-the-art facility completely funded by the Intrepid Fallen Heroes Fund. Best part of this is that we have 90 to 94 percent success rate. Master Sergeant Brogan opened up about his experience with trauma, explaining how on the outside he's in one piece, no prosthetic limbs and no scars. But that doesn't mean there's not battle damage and that doesn't mean we can't make improvements. And places like the Invisible Wound Center help us when we're damaged, not broken. This new center is expected to be opened within a year. I'm News 13's Peyton Lo Cicero, Panhandle Strong.